All right, what's up, my friends? Welcome. We're playing some historic today. Um, I don't recall if this thing was a freshly brewed or not. I think it was. It was, I believe. So we've been doing uh, some updates on freshly brewed decks. Those who don't know, freshly brewed is a show on my YouTube where I play brand new untested decks. Uh, we just, I build a deck and we just play it. There's no, no testing, no practice. We just play a deck and see how it goes. Maybe it wasn't, honestly. Well, whatever. Freshly brewed is still great anyway. And, um, regardless, forget what I just said. And anyway, um, we have here a, uh, I call it Party LLC. This is a, a party company deck. Of course, Party didn't really get there and constructed in standard. Uh, party of the Mechanic accounts to you, wants to see you have a cleric, a rogue, a warrior, and a wizard in play. And, um, we can do that in Historic, honestly. And, and I've always said in Modern, for years now, you can take basically any reasonable creature deck and add four company to it, and you have a playable deck in modern. Not like a great deck, but a playable deck for sure, because company is just that good. So we're assembling a party here. Why are we assembling a party? I'll tell you why. Archpriest of Iona is a really good card. It's a star two for one. It has power for your party. You have a full party. You can give a creature plus one, plus one, and flying, which is insane. Awesome way to break through for an aggro deck. We also have concerted defense, uh, which is one blue for, it's like a super spell pierce, basically. Um, However, however big your party is, it's that much better for a Spell Pierce. So Force, force Spike by itself, and then Spell Pierce with one creature, and extends on from there. Really good card. Similar to um, uh, Stubborn Denial. So, really, really good card. We got Hollow Blade here. We got Nimble Trap Binders of Rogue. And uh, it can be unblockable. And with a full party, all of your creatures will draw a card when you deal damage. It's awesome. And then we have one of the better cards here, Linvala. Shield of Seagate, 3-3 three, three, Flyer for 3, already good. You can sacrifice it to give your entire squad Hexproof or Instructable, also good. And then, if you have a full party, you can detain something for a turn, so it can't attack or use the abilities, which is also awesome. So that's really cool. And then we have Deputy here as a Wizard, which is uh, as a removal spell, as a creature. Borrower is a removal spell, it's a Rogue. We have Rogue Refiner here as a 3-2, but draws a card, it's a Rogue. Um, we have Pelkler as a Warrior, so we have 4 Warriors, we have 8 Warriors. We, got some, we have uh, 86 Rogues. Uh, we got six wizards, and we're on the lightest on clerics. We have four archpriests, but of course the paragon also counts as a cleric too, which is pretty cool. Um, mana base is a mana base, uh, four, four company, and then one squad commander has a, has a top end card. Oh yeah, I wanted to add the one mana rogue elf. You're right. Ooh, angel, you're right. You're right. Um, did I want to add that? No, that, that was the standard version of a deck, actually. I don't think you want that, that card in this deck. Never mind. Forget I said that. that that's, for, that's for standard, I think. And then squad commander is your topping, your top off card. Um, full party means your entire squad gets plus on plus so and instructable until end of turn, and it makes tokens, which is awesome. Cyborg's got, got some good ones here. Um, Masked Vandal's a new addition. Obviously, the Shapeshifter was really, really good. Uh, we got Melee Mage is a wizard. Skyclave, too good not to play. Ishtar, too good not to play. Uh, Remorseful Cleric is a cleric. It's also Graveyard Hate. Sanctuary against removal, and then Concerted Defense, uh, the fourth copy. Deck's super cool. Let's jump right in. And uh, if you missed L LOL Mentals, check it out uh, on my YouTube. Deck is just way too cool. Uh, way too much fun. Let's go. Party time. Get some meatloaf in the oven. Let's go. Luminarch, Luminarch Aspirant's like... It's fine. I'm not a big fan of that card. Uh, it's just really, really slow. It's very vulnerable against removal. Last time we played this, like, I'm pretty sure we went with 3 0. So, yeah, no base camp. No base camp. You're correct. Uh, opponent's playing Yorian. Great. So I want to try to do some quick games here before dinner. Opponent's playing Yorian. Uh, we're in Mulligan. Uh, much better. We're going to keep. I'm going to clear a deputy. Uh, they're playing Yorian. They're a control deck. It's not going to be good. We have one drop, two drop company, which is perfect. So. Um, swamp. Thoughts. Oh, a lot of Thoughtseize is in, in Historic. Um, I would say that well over half our games today have been against Thoughtseize. Took the Hollow Blade. Interesting. All right. We'll just put that way. Or in green. Puck clicker. Sure. Double Company is real good. By far the best card in the deck. It's not even close. Oh, my God. Yeah, it's just Thoughtseize, Thoughtseize. Wow. So, a few things have happened here that are strange. 
One is my opponent played a Blood Crypt. So now they have Rakdos mana in play with a Yorian. Number two is... We drew a card they thought seized. Love it. Love it. Let's go. We're a little light on cards, but... So yeah, what what is the... Like Grixis, maybe? Are they Mardu? What's the... Uh... All right, they're Mardu. Mardu, Oath of Kaya. Ouchie, wowie. Uh, yeah, that's that's a pain. All right. I mean, literally all Mardu does is kill creatures, so he could be in trouble here. Uh, Thoughtseize bug remains strong. No vaccine for that shit. Yeah. I mean, they could have, like, Doom Foretold. Something, I guess. I don't, I don't know. De oh, they're, they're a demonic pack deck, sure. So they're gonna... All right, we're gonna draw land here, folks. We need to land big time. Land! Woo! Bingo. And we're gonna do this, uh, I guess on their turn, right? There's no reason to do it now. Yeah. I like they have counter spells, so. And we'll just say, yeah. They are at eight, and we have two big threats. They're gonna go four and gain four. Is there any card in our deck that stops this? Um, Linbala could give it Hexproof. Um, and they might just Wrath us. Yeah, this is fine, I guess. I guess we could, yeah, we, we could Rogue Refiner and draw a card. That's true. I don't want to get Wrath. That's my concern. Maybe just go like Land Wrath. Um... We're not going to use Linval on this. We'd rather have Linval than have Hollow Blade. So we have to hit exactly Rogue Refiner. I don't think that's worth um, getting Wrathed. The risk of getting Wrathed. So. All right, folks, use they in chat. Our opponent is the they. No idea who they are. They could be anybody behind that screen. Hi, Jim. Uh, Trial of Ambition. All right, we'll do this. We'll do this. Double Archpriest. Could have been better. Could have been better. So yeah, the, the thing is, these, these Mardu decks are literally just all removal spells, which is not going to be good for us. Um, draw land, sure. Yeah, we're in trouble here. Honestly, probably. Draw two, sure. Oh my god. Alright. Yeah, like... They probably can't ever beat, ever beat a control deck, but they're going to beat the crap out of us, I guess. Alright. Yeah. We're at four. Alright, so we'll sack we'll discard this in response. Uh, Elemental deck is a nut. The Elemental deck is so good. They sacked the, they sacked the Pact. Alright, so they're not going to like give it to us. Oh my god. Alright, yeah, we're dead. No hasters here, that's for sure. We drew, if we drew company right there, like exactly company, I think you might have been fine. But we did not, so... The good news is that, that our, our counter spells are good here. Um, we should have them. Like that, like that, sure. So they're gonna get a bunch of tokens. Yeah, I mean, this is the kind of deck where like just beats the crap out of creature decks. You can't beat anything else usually, so of course we're a creature deck. But we got counter spells. We got counter spells. Yeah, so it's going to eight with two boxes in play. We're just dead. All right, sure. So like, tough game. Tough game. Um, we get to sideboard though. We get to bring in Shaper Sanctuary. That's, that's a good one. Sanctuary, Mast Vandal. Um, this doesn't actually stop Doom for Dole, which is funny. A lot of a lot of science happening in chat. No! <laughs> um, we're gonna want to. Uh, I think that uh, Deputy is pretty bad. Even though it can like mop things up, it's actually just like really bad against removal, so we'll get rid of those. And then 
I don't see big on bar. Actually, I guess mimic's worse. And then I want concerted defense for sure. We are lowering our, our creature count here a decent amount. Maybe the squad commander isn't good. So now we're at 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 18, 19, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20. So we got 27 creatures. Still good. That's still good. That's fine. We have we have four one mana counter spells for their entire deck. So obviously at any point we can uh, you know if we get a counter to spell at any point in that game we'd won the game easily. So chat's talking about heliophysics. I don't know what's going on. I'm gonna stay far away from chat right now. I got nothing to do with them. Gonna keep. Pretty happy to be keeping seven here against the Thought Seas deck. A lot of science people. Our word of the day for YouTube comments is nerd. We're gonna do a, a word of the day for every uh, for every day. So all you YouTube folks, you're supposed, to leave, you're supposed to like, leave a comment, and subscribe on every video. Well, your word of the day is nerd. In case you were wondering. In case you were wondering. All right. I mean. Oh my god. So unfortunately, if we play a creature every turn and they kill a creature every turn, we're probably gonna lose. But uh, we're gonna play a trap binder here, and we're gonna play this tap. I wanna, I wanna kick, kick this power gun for sure. So, can the word tomorrow be academic? Nope, only nerd. All right, so sure. I'm a little scared of his turn, honestly. Oh, they have a stupid... Oh, my God. I, I should have saw that coming. That was really stupid. All right. Um, maybe they'll... Well, I can flash in, actually. It won't be able to... Bleep. We can't be blocked. All right, sure. So now my thing can't be blocked. I should have played a pre-combat thing, but... We have Rogue... More like we have Rogue Rogue. Demonic Pack? How do they have, like, the perfect curve with 80 cards in their deck? I don't understand. How do they always have it, chat? How do they always have it? Huh? 80 card deck. Packed on four again. One, two... They went one, two, three, four. Up the curve. Unbelievable. Um... Alright, so... Yeah, sure. It's like Collector. They have a Wrath of Dead, but we can't play around that at this point. We should, we should go. We need to go, go, go. So, unblockable attack. Take five. Uh, they can mine rot me here, which would suck. But what are you gonna do? No, they're gonna they're gonna go for the old uh, the old lightning helix. Yeah. I'm gonna kill the flyer and pump the collector. What else you got for me? Okay, that's probably bad. So we're probably getting Wrath next turn. Can we just draw a Counterspell, please? Just draw a Counterspell off the top. If we draw a Counterspell off the top, I guarantee you win this game. If our top card is Concerted Defense, I guarantee victory this game. Oh my god. Not anymore. I take it back. I take it back. Alright. Um, They're just gonna Mind Rot us. Play this. Stuff's unblockable. We draw land. Get in for unblockable damage. So they... I'm going to hold the land in the hopes that they don't mind rot us. <laughs> Alright, so I'll keep the company. Try and draw land. Like imagine what the matchup looks like if they're if we're not playing creatures, you know? They just have like Trial of Ambition, Blood Chief's Thirst, you know, uh, Othakaya, whatever, whatever, whatever. Why play Concerned over actual spell pierce? Because Concerned is better at every point unless you have zero creatures to play. Somebody play a prank on me. I guess I'll draw two cards. Harmless offering. Linvala. Oh my god. Oh, we can't kill him this turn, and now we're dead. I, I, I'll, I'll allow it. We'll, we'll allow it. They're going to harm us offering us. Good for them, right? You know, good for them. Good for them. Uh, we couldn't even kill us with a Mass Vandal, because it's, uh, we obviously, uh, 
we that we have it. So I'm sure, um, I'm sure there's no cool animation for this, but we'll try it. Draw a card. I I I I I, I hate you. Oh my god. But them one, folks. Them, not him. Them. All right. It's very simple. All right. So we'll let we'll let, we'll let, them, let them kill us. Let them kill us. Here we go. Say go. We can't. Uh... Show me what you can. I don't think, think that any um. You should quit now. Yep. No cool animation. No cool animation. All right. It's a pretty tough first match there. Um. Pretty hard to beat that beat that deck with any creature deck, you know. All right, let's go. Oh, and one, we died to the all removal deck. It's fine. I'm not sad about it. I'm not sad at all. Round two. Remember, folks, we're brought to you by BCWSupplies.com. Best sleeves in the market are right here. The Elite Two Deck Card sleeves, and uh, you can buy a five pack of them. Use the promo code. They're like less than seven dollars a pack. Super awesome. Super high quality, and. Uh, Check it out, bcwsupplies.com. Promo code Jim10, 10, 10% off your order. Also, deck boxes, binders, card sorting trays, you name it, they got it. bcwsupplies.com. King, that was you? You 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 killed all my stuff and gave me a bad present. I don't like your present. You can have it back. All right, uh, we're going to keep this. It's not great. It's fine. What's up, kill switch? Yeah, it's kind of lame how a lot of things don't have animations, honestly. But it's the world we live in. You know, Watsy can't afford it. They can't afford us to give uh to give uh can't afford to give us a good experience here in Arena. Maze Mind Tome. Oh, we drew a defense. It's on, folks. You gotta draw defense against these decks, you know. Counter the wrath. The game is over. Pump it up. I played a really awesome mono black control deck on my CoolStuffInc.com video on Monday. Really, really cool deck. Uh, Solemn, Golos, Blood of the Snow. Really, really sweet deck. All right, so... Question here is, am I willing to tap out for a turn or not and play Linbala? They'd have to have actual Languish. The deck I was playing played Blood of the Snow. Um, I'm just going to jam I'm gonna jam. Sure. Alright, so. Oh, removal spells, you know? A lot of removal spells. Don't draw no more spell uh uh lands, please. Don't draw any more lands. Hey, they're playing, they're playing with that. Cool. This is probably the, probably the, uh, the deck I played my Cool Stuff video. So if you like my opponent's deck, check out my video on CoolStuffInc.com. All right, pretty good there. Pretty good. We draw a Hollow Blade. Sure. Uh, play Hollow Blade. We have Warrior, Wizard, Cleric. We're not going to trade our Priest for, uh, for this thingy, so we'll just play this tats. Tag for three. There you go. The video also contains Goth Jim in the intro. That is true. That is true. If you ever want to see uh, see Goth Jim, go watch the video. Scry top, sure. They're gonna cast Blood on the Snow. You ready? You ready? Yeah, this this is this is my deck from the video. Nope, I'm gonna play Golos. Sure. Thanks, Scarlet. I do look good. All right, Golos is gonna get the the World Tree probably. Yep. Yippers. All right, so this is a pretty big butt, honestly, and. Uh, oh my God, Becky. That's pretty good too. Uh, okay. I mean, could be doing a little better here, but we have their next two spells covered, and we complete the party here. We attack for a lot. A lot. But Adonto Vanguard, too, too bad Adonto Vanguard is a soldier. Yeah, Adonto Vanguard is a lot better than Hollow Blade is. Like a lot better. 
All right, so they draw a card, gain four. They got three cards off of uh, the thing, which is pretty good. All right, so Cabal Stronghold here, making six black. Alright, I guess we're dead. Uh, we can't deal 14 damage um, before the Ulamog gets us. Alright, well, I guess we're gonna lose. Uh, party, party, party. Party, party, party. Okay. Alright. Nice spell pierces, idiot. They played all creatures. They played all creatures. Alright, so we're gonna uh, bring in Shaper Sanctuary, Mass to Vandal. Um. Did I play Vintage Cube? Yeah, I mean, the last ho uh, last holiday season, we did a crazy Vintage Cube for charity event. That was freaking awesome. And uh, we raised like a bajillion dollars for charity. It was awesome. But I'll, I'll cube at some point. It's hard to do so many things, you know? The bright side is my opponent watched my cool stuff videos. So that's great. Um, and then we're going to take out the Mimic. Take out the Deputies. And Vandal's really good against them. That's nice. That's a nice one. I'm going to only play three defense, honestly. They have so many creatures, it's actually like a little bit of liability, so. The old Ulamog. Ulimog Mog. Not the kind of Mog that we like. Not the kind of Mog that we like. Yeah, I mean, can't, can't ball against that. Let's go. They crashed our party, Yana. Aw, oh, come on. What are you doing to me here? Hollow Blade. Linvala. Maze Mine, sure. Maze Mine on the draw is pretty slow. Hollow Blade number two. I mean, we can't play both of these and play this tap, so we gotta play Linvala here. Otherwise, we can't company next turn, so. This is the Sanctum will come in tapped. Linvala's still good, obviously. And then Linvala also is Wrath Insurance, because they have Blood on the Snow. Scry Scry is good for us. Scry Scry is good. Because um, it means they waste cards off this, which is awesome. If all you do is scry a Maze Mind Tome, it's two mana, gain four. That's it. Let's scry a bunch, you know. Mind Stone, sure. Oh, wow, no land. Ooh, no land for you, huh? We're actually going to jam here. We're not going to play... We have Warrior, Wizard, Cleric. Yeah, we're not going to... Uh, we're not going to company here. We're going to play... Rogue Refiner and Archpriest. Draw a card, complete the party, and lock down their Mind Stone, right? In any combat your turn, if you have a full party, choose to target non land permanent opponent controls until your next turn. It can't attack or block and can't be activated. So we can target the Mind Stone, and we have a freaking Stone Rain in our party deck. Game. Game. Calling it right now. Everyone get off the field. The game's over. Game's over. Everybody go home. Scry? Sure. Bottom again? Sure. Can't attack or block. Can't activate. Let's go. Game three. On the draw. Let's go. Let's go. Cry of the Carnarium. Yeah, I mean, if they had land, cry. That's that's bad for us, but what are you going to do, you know? What are you going to do? Why are you having negative thoughts, McIntyre? McIntyre? Which is it? I'm sorry. Uh, ooh, Sanctuary's nice. Not a great hand, but Sanctuary's really good, so... What's up, Snook? Are you going to cry? Alright. Uh, another company? Sure. Shaper Sanctuary. Go. We need some lands. We need some lands. First, good detain. The ball is pretty good. When it works, it works. 
And when it doesn't work, it's just like a super selfish spirit, you know? Oh, wow. Turn to Mind Stone, tilt. Oh my god, we're dead. Oh, no. Runner, runner, no land. I'm a draw. McIntyre? Gotcha, my friend. My, my apologies. Have I opened any Time Spiral Remastered? Nah, I was really hoping to get one of those boxes from Watsy that everyone was getting, and I don't think I'm going to get one, which kind of stinks. But, all right, we have no lands that we're going to lose now, so they have, like, the perfect draw on them on the play. Um, I would like to... I might... I'm, 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 I don't know. I'm going to buy some cards from my queue, but I probably won't buy any packs. I'm still holding out hope that maybe, uh, you know, mine got lost in the mail and it'll be here soon. Uh, no blocks. No blocks. Yeah, this is like this is like the ideal draw for them for sure. I missed a land drop, but all right, we drew. We did draw a uh, did draw land, I guess. But now they just have like infinite mana and two big blockers. This is gonna be pretty hard from here on out. All right, so there you go. What are you doing this turn? Don't don't be bad for us. They only have four swamps, so the the stronghold's like only breaking even at the moment. If we get to untap here, maybe there's a chance. You know, untap and draw land, obviously. Like, unfortunately, they haven't needed to kill anything yet, so our sanctuary has been basically worthless. Tank, new sub. What's the name away from? Thanks so much. Appreciate that. I believe it would be uncouth of me to contact Watsy and be like, hey, where's my free product you're supposed to send me? You know? I mean, it's a gift. It's a free thing, you know? So, all right. So, they're going to Wrath here, it looks like. Um, we just take this. Sack Linval. Save the Priest. It's Blood of a Snow. Look at Salem back, which sucks, but... What's PX? Oh, that's a new one. I did not play that card in my deck. Well, we're dead. Um, because that's insane. I am the master here. Yeah, that's that's uh battle to the grave. They were allowed to waste not. I wasn't a cyborg, yeah. Sure. Alright, I mean like if we just can't draw lands, we just probably can't win, so what are we gonna do? Oh, it seems like kind of a difficult matchup. Um, just like the Wrath of God Rebel deck. I mean, like, we have, like, defenses and stuff, too. But, like, it just kind of just didn't work out this game. We kept, like, a, a kind of tough hand on the draw. Just didn't draw any lands for a while. Obviously, we had mana. Could have countered it. This game's totally different. Like, if we, like, draw a land exactly next turn, we can, like, company untap commander, maybe. But, yeah. It's also, our spell piercers is getting much worse. When you when you miss a few land drops, your opponent accelerates like five times, and they have two strongholds in play. Your spell piercers are pretty bad. Yeah, all right, that's fine. Tough. No parties today. Jeez, where my where my party at? Where my party at? Huh? Hello, wizards of the coast. I saw that Benjamin Stark got a Time Spiral block. As you know, Ben Stark is a Magic player and a streamer. I, comma, am also a Magic player and a streamer. I would like to know, comma, if maybe my box got lost in the mail, period. Thank you for your correspondence, comma, yours truly, comma, Jim Davis MTG, period. Enter. P.S. You are all very good looking. Think it'll work? Think it'll work? Huh? You see, flattery is perfect, right? Send it? Send. 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 Best idea yet. Alright, we, we gotta win here, folks. We gotta get a W. My meatloaf is riding on it. I got meatloaf waiting for me. I got, I got a hockey game waiting for me. My couch is waiting for me. All on this game, right here. Right now. Alright. Well, that's another land. Uh, sure. Yeah. I don't think the deck wants the one drop. 
You can't have too many one drops in your company, Dagger. Your company's too bad. Somebody's playing a prank on me. Drown Catacomb Swamp. All right. All right. Um. Yes. Hollow Blade. Ten of ten would send two boxes. Thanks. Appreciate it, everyone. You're all great. I actually get, I actually get cool stuff from Watsy. I get, I've gotten like a, a box for every set recently, which is super awesome. Very, very cool of them. I really, really, really do appreciate it. So, joking aside, it is pretty hard to be like, yo, where's my box? Like, they've given me so much stuff over the years, I can't really ever complain. So, all right. There's Soaring Thought Thief. Um, they mill a company? God, I hate you. Plan standard. Robber, sure. Hmm. Linvela. And I want to use defense to uh to push through my spell. I think we're gonna we're just gonna hard cast him and make this this turn and make a second hollow blade. Make a white. And if they counter it, who cares, obviously. Give me that one. It's your turn. Play a second Thought Thief so I can deputy the crap out of you. No? Nothing? Sure. I think they made the Rogue cards like a little bit too good. Um, I, I like the deck, honestly, and I like it I liked it like a, a, a high synergy deck is playable and standard, but gameplay-wise, people seem to really, really hate it, and it would probably still be playable at times if it was like a little bit worse. I'd say that they missed a little bit high on Rogues. A little Deputy Defense. Those are the cards I'm playing next turn. Does it stay a rogue after the copy? It does, actually. So it is a rogue and a warrior. Alright, so... Okay. Rogue, warrior, wizard, cleric. Alright. Play Linvala. I want to leave out. I'm not going to fight to fight back during a counter spell, so. Play one ball. I agree. I like, I like the gameplay of Rogues, but I like. I think it's. I do agree it's interesting to play against and stuff, but the good hands are like a little too good, which means the knobs are turned like a little a little too far, I think. Um, Alright, so that's good. Now we play our Archpriest. We get in with our thingies, and next turn is Deputy plus, plus Defense. They have no Lurus. So they, they can have a stupid... They're going to Fatal Push this? It's an odd time to do that, for sure. Little 11. So we have Deputy plus Defense next turn. And then Deputy again. If they were to play like the Ink Eyes here and get back my Deputy, we lose the game on the spot. Please, God, don't do that. Oh, God. Oh, God, no. Oh god. Oh god, they're gonna do it. Oh my god. Oh god. Oh god, please don't. Please don't. Oh no. Here it comes. Hello, darkness, my old friend. God, stop. That's a priority. I'm trying to do my, my stick here. The worst part here is having to hit the space bar over and over again. Alright, yeah, that was pretty stupid. 
All right. Um, yeah, we lose. I guess. I guess I could like the deputy, the deputy, and then I get to copy the deputy, and then also if deputy dies, it comes back for me, right? So, yeah, we're going to copy our own deputy. Make the Zara thingy. Oh, we could just block it. Um, yeah, we actually hit the Soaring Thought Thief. We can just block the Zareth Sand with the Hollow Blade. And if this deputy dies, I actually get my deputy back, I think. This deputy dies. It's my deputy, so. I shot the sheriff. Right. Come on, opponent. I'm a little getting cold. All right, so I only have one card left. We have four spike for four and deputy. Yeah, like. Pretty easy block here. I could actually just block with the deputy and just take it. Or I can just block and discard the paragon. So I'm playing deputy next turn anyway. This is actually pretty interesting. We double block, it dies, and I guess I would take this. I'm still, I'm still discarding a card then. It's kind of fun. Well, they have another, they have a second one, don't they? They have a second one, don't they? I hate them. I hate them. I hate them. It's pretty cool that I get my own thing back. They stack that. They draw a card. Um, obviously, we're like ahead now, right? Sure. I mean, like, tax keys. Eve Guild Enforcer. That's tilt. Can't, like, not attack here. Okay, that's actually not that bad. So, because they're going to block and kill my deputy, and they'll play the other deputy to get back both, both thieves. The Rangers' entire coaching staff is out on COVID precaution, so the Hartford coaching staff is coaching the game. <laughs> that's embarrassing. Uh, okay, that's fine. So this dies. With seven. Yeah, no cards. I know, I get it. Deputy. That's so funny. I mean, they got no cards in hand. They literally have nothing but a, a Thieves Guild Enforcer at this point. So, and if they draw, I guess we can't counter down the lock. So that kind of sucks. So our, our defense has gotten pretty bad over the last few turns. We want them to top, we want them to top the two top deck into the store. That'd be the best possible thing. So one of the few things we can counter with this. <laughs> okay. Then Vela. Cool. I mean, now we can't die with that base. Too risky. So we're at we're at four. All right, it's the Hollow Blade. Super, super safe. So five. Say so go. What'd you draw? Another enforcer? Sure. So make trades if we have to. Raisin borrower off the top rope. What a sicko. I was dumb. I have this thing in play. Never mind, we're good. Oh, I shouldn't have cast that I screwed up. I screwed up. 
I'm hungry. I'm hungry. Fizzle that. Now I got a block, though. What are you going to do? Yeah, really, really bad play on the uh, defense. I thought we were just dead, so I was just like, maybe they'll be able to misclick, but obviously we weren't dead. All right. Um, five to three. We have Wizard Warrior. Let's draw a company off the top, right? Just ship it. Ship the company. Or a refiner. Refiner's good, too. All right. Uh, got a block. They're dead to a lot of stuff here. They're dead to a lot of stuff. But some stuff. Or land. Or land. All right. Well, now we can't win. Tough. Tough games. Tough games with this deck so far. All right. Um, so we, if we block, we they get back both thought thieves, so we can't beat them anymore. So yeah, let's bring in. Um, I actually disappointed how bad the defenses were that game. Bring in Sanctuary Skyclave. Cleric can exile cards from the graveyard if it dies. It's kind of cool. So, like, if it dies, we'll exile our own graveyard. Get rid of Mimic. Um, squad Commander's kind of clunky. We got a lot of cards here, actually. Skyclave's definitely good. Borrower's, like, not great, I guess. It's, like, fine. I guess it blocks the 1-3. Uh, the Deputy. Linvala's, like, okay. It's not, like, great or anything. Trap Finder's also a little mopey. Cut like Trap Finder, Trap Finder, Linvala. 4, 8, 12, 16, 20, 23 lands. Defense seems so good to force the spells through, just like didn't really work out that game. Huh. Uh, maybe Sanctuary is bad. Like, a lot of the removal, removal is just counter spells, so uh, I'm just going to play one of these. I never want to draw two, I guess. I don't know. I'm not sure. Okay. Okay. Sure. I've seen better, but who wants to bet we draw one drop next turn? Any updates to the elemental deck? Just what I played a couple hours ago or an hour ago. It's on my, it's on my Twitter. All right. I mean, power gone it is. We have Deputy Linvala, Skyclave. We have Company, too. This isn't, isn't too bad. We have party payoffs. We have the one drop. We have Linvala. Uh, we are playing one squad commander with the rogue thing. Alright, it's Paragon. Alright, let's just jam. Skyclave or Linbala here. Um, I only have one card in the bin. Robbers, I guess like keeping them off of... Uh, off the first few mills is pretty important. They usually have the one three though. I'd rather just kill that though. Let's play the play the one ball. It's a three two. It's a monster. It's an elf cleric rogue warrior wizard. Very well traveled. Taju Paragon is. The ball is good. Obviously the body in the ball is pretty great. A three three flyer is uh, lines up very well with all their stuff. There's Thought Thief, sure. Somewhat of a Renaissance elf, yes. No worries, my friend. Jaeger bomb. I like Jaeger. Jaeger's good. If you haven't followed, you with that follow button. Of course, watching on YouTube, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Nice long stream today. Hope you all enjoyed it. I'll be streaming, uh... Maybe Friday? I'm not sure yet, honestly. Things are very busy around the around the around the house. We are uh, Nicole's getting surgery in a few months, a few weeks, I mean. We're 
Still renovating. Still got finished moving. Get the house cleaned up before she gets her surgery. Rebuilding a stream. There's a lot of stuff going on. They're gonna drown my Linvalo, which is like fine. Sagging to give things extra, I guess. So they can't post combat. Uh, post combat. What she's first, something like that. I don't know. We have a. Uh, now we have Skyclave. We, can, we could company. They could have one like a, a spell piercing kind of spell. It seems very doubtful though. We should resolve, resolve company here, I think. Unfortunately, a lot of our like removal spells are actually already accounted for. Uh, but. Green. Ship it. I don't know, folks. No parties today, I guess. No parties today. I mean, that, that's that's the entire game right there. Like, the entire game. If we just hit two decent creatures there, um, the the game is, like, not over, but, like, we're in insanely good shape. But now we just wasted turn four, didn't do anything, and now we're just super far behind. Pretty lame. Pretty lame. The vehicle deck was cool. It, it, it needs some work, but it's cool. And now we just counter everything we should lose. Pretty, uh, pretty frustrating. I can't even attack if they have a second Thought Thief. Huh. Yeah, I mean, like... Really can't afford to fall behind against Rogue, so when you make a play like that and you miss them the company, you just you just instantly lose the game, which is pretty, pretty crappy. I think it's part of the feel-bad of Rogues, is that, like, you just lose the game on the spot if you ever fall behind, because you can't ever come back, so... Alright, um... I mean, we can, like, Paragon here and pump them up. I'd love to kick it, but we gotta resolve two spells here, I think, so we'll just play it. Then we can deputy post pumping the things up. Let's pump these things up. Get a deputy now. Because then Thought Thief can't actually it's like it's still kill those actually. I don't know why it is now. Um, and now they have a brazen bar. They should, they should get to kill my thing too. That was that was not not a good not a good idea. That was stupid. All right. Wow. Are we turning it around here? Are we turning it around? Wind robber is so much worse than Luris. Yeah, I mean, we're gonna not attack with the deputy because there's a number of things that could they could block it and kill it. Can't afford to give him back the sword thought thief. You can't come back against Rogue, says Streamer Man. Streamer Man might be wrong. I mean, if they literally stop doing things, you can you can come back. Like, they haven't cast a spell in two turns, you know? Nighthawk Scavenger? That's rude. Uh, okay. That's a card, I guess. Just kidding. Get off my plane. Yeah, I mean, uh... I guess. All right, game three. I, I guess I lied. Um, the only way you can come back against rogues is when the you know the law of the universe says that I gotta be wrong. So, all right. So we're gonna uh, we're gonna um, later wild um, take out Shaper Sanctuary and Limbala. Cutting Limbala is terrible. Actually, I don't know why I did that. It's fine. Sure. Last game of the day. Last game of the day. Let's go. Let's go. Destiny spinner. 
Uh, yeah, this hand's great. This hand beats. Two one drops, two lands. Most important thing against rogues is to get under them. Don't want them to get ahead. And this hand is uh, a lot of one drops. Win robber, sure. Defense, sure. Definitely want to draw a land or two here. Um, so we can have defense up. We can have company available. Una's Blackguard. Each other rogue you control enters the battlefield with a plus and plus encounter on it. And every creature with a plus and plus encounter on it deals damage to a player. The player discards a card. Okay. Cards like Destiny Spinner and Prowling Serp Pod are traps. Uh, they don't actually aren't actually good against counter spells because those decks also have removal spells. So you just resolve your Destiny Spinner and then Fatal Push it. it doesn't actually do anything. Same with same with Prowling Serp Pod. Cards that can beat removal and counter spells like Carnage Tyrant or something like that, you know, are are actually good. Okay, number two, sure. We're now at two cards in the graveyard. This card seems kind of off-plan for rogues, honestly. Alright, we didn't draw land, which is pretty bad, unfortunately. Um, however, they're probably going to play a spell here. We have... If they have the... The 1-3 here, I forgot that it was really, really fast. So we're going to play Pug Lector and Sego with defense up. What are they doing? Please draw land. Me. I want to draw land. Please. Please draw me a land. Oh my god. Get off my plane. I said it. The soundboard said it. I just... Get off my plane. Sorry, Harrison. Plane. I didn't mean to interrupt you there. That's what I'm talking about. Now we draw land. What she first. Jeez, Kirk. That's sick though, it pumps the thing up, so. Get it for two, whatever. Can we draw a land, please? Yes, we can! Um. Linvala. Linvala. Pump it up! Pump it up! Thrun did nothing wrong. Thrun's pretty good. Elf Warrior Angel Wizard. Alright. They only got two cards left. They didn't attack either. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Let's go. Combat. Smash. Brazen bar at the ready. Yeah, whatever. Whatever. Say it again, me folks. Get off my plane. Get out of here. Go away. Make a chump block. You gotta do it. Can't even draw a card. Sorry, robber. Now, the bad news is that they can black guard and trickster me. The good news is it doesn't really do anything. Like, they would just get, like, a crappy creature. And they're at one. So, I am pretty sure they're dead. A little comeback here. A little comeback trail. I'm earning my dinner here. I'm earning my dinner. There's a hexproof, uncounterable haste creature in standard to see zero play. Well, it it costs seven. So, like, what deck can play that card? You know, seven drops ain't so good against good against rogues, and there are no hard counter are hard are no hard control decks. So, seven is an awesome number. Says hoist seven seven seven. Come on, opponent, you're dead. It's dinner time. Boom! After it was all over, he took us in the house of service pancakes. We've we've ranked up to platinum tier two like seven times this stream. <laughs> That's great. YouTube folks, like, comment, subscribe. I love y'all. Um, 
Definitely a rough run with this deck. Uh, this deck is a little lacking in power. I'm not going to lie. It's a little lacking in power. Um, needs a little more. Needs a little more. Uh, it's pretty sweet. I mean, when it runs out well, it runs out well. But it's kind of got a curve pretty well. And draw company and draw defense at the right time. But definitely a sweet fun deck for sure. I'm pretty sure we, we threw it last time with this deck. But a 1-2 this time. Not ideal. Not ideal. You two folks, love you. Like, comment, subscribe.